Hey guys, Slow and Rusty, it's Saturday and it's Datsun Day. And I uh, wanted to show you guys uh, just a few things that I'm gonna do, uh, or will be doing to my uh, 280ZX. Um, it's back in the air, one of its favorite positions on jack stands. Many of you Datsun guys can relate. Anyway, just got these brand new Technotoy tuning, lower control arms and tension compression rods. And I'm going to be installing them today. Looking forward to doing that. And I thought I would shoot a quick video of the before. And then I'll do one after. At the same time, I also bought their billet uh, steering coupling. As you can see here down here. Here's the factory one uh, over here. I've already taken it off. <coughs> and uh, I was actually kind of curious to see what they weighed. So... Um, not that it's uh, going to make much of a difference, but I thought, oh, let's throw it on the scale and see what they weigh. So it looks like the, uh, the factory stuff weighs in right at 300 grams. And, uh, the Techno Toy Tuning bullet coupling is, that's uh, about 180 grams. So interesting weight savings there. It's a nice piece, well machined, beautiful. Um, like all their stuff as an engineer, I certainly appreciate, uh, the quality uh, that goes into their designs and also the, the finish. And I'm looking forward to actually installing all these uh, suspension and steering components on the car. And as an engineer, um, man, I love I love all this stuff. It, uh, it's gonna be fantastic. You know, I always say that uh, my 280ZX is one of the most predictable cars I've ever owned and, and driven. And I've driven a bunch of cars over the years with some very trick suspension. And as old as this car is, it's it just it blows me away how well balanced and how well behaved it is, regardless of of the speed and and how fast you you uh, you take a corner. So um, this car is really beautifully set up. Um, so the uh, the factory lower control arms are going to come off, as you can see down here. A little bit dark. I actually have a set of uh, Technotoy tunings, uh, lower con uh, sorry tension compression rods, as you can see right here. But the new ones uh, are designed for their lower control arms. So all this stuff is going to come out, and uh, you can see the my coilovers as per my original video or earlier video. And uh, one thing that I didn't feature before was actually uh, Technotoy tunings. Um, camber plates and I think I have the very first set ever made for 280ZX. I actually worked with the owner. We actually go back probably to 2002 and uh, when I was very much into the AE86 AE scene and uh, had a bunch of their very early products on my car uh, back then. So many moons ago, 17 years ago. Wow. Anyway, um, they came up uh, with this very cool camber plate setup and I installed it on my car. These were actually installed in 2006 or 7, I believe. And uh, did a pretty neat job actually of, of making the right size hole here in the strut tower. That took quite a bit of time. I had to make a jig here at home to cut it out and then fit it in um, as the factory hole for the, uh, for the top of the strut. Uh, is is very small, so I had to make a make a jig just to to make it all fit. Anyway, so there we have it. Uh, latest latest uh, project for today. Uh, next video will will be the after with everything installed. Hopefully that'll be uh, either tomorrow, or the day after, and uh, also I guess <coughs> while uh, there's uh, there's my carbon fiber 280ZX hood that I'm actually getting ready to permanently install. I'm, I'm doing some really trick things to the hinges and to the fasteners and I'll have a video coming up on that as well. Uh, so be on the lookout for that video and I think I'll name that video Fascinated with Fasteners because I truly am. I think uh, nuts and bolts and fasteners in, in general just are so cool and it's it's just amazing um, that what they what they do and their purpose in life. Anyway, so stainless steel fasteners and uh, 
wanted to show you guys some wheels I picked up actually today. These are some great, cool, old school 14 by seven appliance wheels. And you old school Datsun guys will appreciate these. Um, they're in really great condition. And uh, bought them uh, from a, a local Datsun guy here. And uh, I think I'll probably refinish them, put my stone rusty touch on them. Uh, polish them up and I think I might do the centers and gloss black anyway so you'll here's the before and uh, I'll shoot a video in the upcoming weeks as I get time to refinish these so uh, anyway more stuff to come stay tuned <laughs>